nuclear destruction. <laughs> G'day mates, and welcome back to Civilization 6 with Mr. Gandhi. Now, you'll notice something. We're on turn 58, and we've got two cities, and we've only just discovered a mainland. Yeah, we got a bit fucked on this run. Isolation is horrendous in Civ 6. But hey, we're making do with what we've got. So we still can't embark. I've made, uh, what's called, us rush right towards that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep an eye on... I'm going to keep these guys over here to make sure no barbs spawn. That's fine. And then we got uh, these warriors will just... Oh, yeah, they can just sit here, sure. Not a worry. Rightio. So we're going to skip through as fast as we can and catch up. So Stonehenge has been built. Players have been defeated. Weird thing, players also include city-states. When that pops up, it might have just been a city-state that died, not a player. Anyway, all good. Um, yeah, let's, let's park him over here, actually. In the jungle. Oh, hello, hello. So we've got wild cards now. Oh, that's right, because we didn't get a great profit. We... Oh, no, hang on a second. Also, it's Hinduism that... Uh, Indians have not Buddhism like Christ I'm dumb, but uh Great people, all individuals of this great type. So I'm guessing all individuals of great profit type have already been claimed. Well hang on, there's five seven. Why is it why is there seven claimed but only five religions? Oh maybe I've only met five religions. No? No, no, I'm... I'm very confused, because there should surely be all seven religions then. Either way, we got fucked. Ugh, damn it. Um, let's see, if, if we can't go faith, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to go... Well, first of all, we'll have to get someone else's religion, uh, but we will go... What do you want to do? Just straight, straight up war? Let's go invade the mainland, shall we? So let's go 100% production towards uh, ancient and classical era naval units. Yes, please. Gandhi's going to war. So we're going to grab the Hanging Gardens, and then we're going to just go and invade uh, Corinth. And I can't grab uh, Zian. No, but we could grab... What's this? Handan? Handan. Wouldn't be too bad. We can even grab the uh, Great Wall of China while we're at it. Ah, yes. We'll keep all the wildlings up in the north. Um. Yeah, I think so. We just really need, we need a proper fleet. So the builder should help us. Oh, I don't know. <sighs> China, shut your face. They bitch and moan when they, uh, when they have less wonders than you. Look, you, you have more wonders than me. I'm gonna declare war. Like, Christ. I mean, I get they bring character and, like, actual, you know, decisions to what you do, but fucking hell they do. Like, they're just whiny bastards. All the AI. Now what do you guys? Just grease galleys, that's fine. Alright. Yeah, let's just keep you there and park you there. That should cover everything. Good. Now, we're going to want... Oh, harbour. Oh, maybe we should build... We should probably get a monument as well. Um, Let's just... Let's start with a galley. Start with a galley. And uh, we'll start producing a proper navy. Greece has been declared a war on by, Ch uh, by China. Interesting, interesting. Actually, where is my boat? Oh, fuck, didn't it get destroyed? Man, man, oh man. Boat, you were the best boat. Why you have to die? Right, you actually just moved to there. Fine. Uh, you, give me some gold and cocoa. Yes, please. That's what we're getting. We're getting gold, cocoa. There was something else we're going to grab, wasn't it? We've already got the citrus. Hang Garden's almost done. What's happening? One cocoa, 71 gold, and open borders. Make that a gold per turn sort of thing. Why can we not... They won't get... Give me Corinth. Okay, no, piss off. I'm sorry, I'm not going to give you my cocoa for 71 gold. Piss off, it's not worth nothing. For 30 turns, not a chance. I mean, I know I've got two, but I can probably sell it to someone else. I don't know why he wouldn't give me gold per turn, though. Oh, hang on. Here's me galley. 
Okay. So we're going to have to see if we can uh, heal it up over here and then we can just rush Corinth with uh, galleys. There is no the ascent to the Ooh. highest story is by stairs, and at their side are water engines, by means of which persons, appointed expressly for the purpose, are continually employed in raising water from the Euphrates into the garden. Well then. I do love the wonder construction, it's really nice. Go on. Thank you. Okay, so drama and poetry complete. Ship building, civics. What is this one? Writers, theater square, amphitheater. That's lovely. Um, we don't really want any of this faith in gold. Okay, we can probably drop the faith for now and go. Uh, two plus gold maybe. Or... Just want to start. I think we should just start buying up units. Okay, so get a bit extra gold. Actually, we don't even have any trade routes, so never bloody mind. Uh, I think, I think, yeah, keep God King for now. And let's swap up to Charismatic Leader. That's probably a better choice. Okay, that's lovely. Good. Right, now, let's grab... And how much does it take to build a... Oh, Quad Marines? Oh, the ranged units, yes. And galleys are only one turn? Okay. Let's start mass-producing ships. So... Galleys are going to give me two turns now. That's perfect. And we just want to meet up and have a big old fleet over here. Now, can these boys heal? No, they need to go back to friendly territory. Righto. Off you go. Okay, you boys park it there. There we go. Now, I think the other luxury we're going to get was uh, the silver, wasn't it? We're going to wait and uh, snatch that up. Actually, what if I... See, getting a quarry would give me bonus uh, production, yeah? So, should I go, what? Uh, there's tile yields. Where is tile yields? Damn you, game. What? What do I need? No. Yield icons. Woo. Okay, stone. Right. And I assume... Why am I in strategic mode? Building quarry would give me an extra. So, it'd be two production there. Um... Building a mine on silver would just give me an extra production and three gold. Yeah, I think we go for the silver. And it will give me the luxury resource as well. What's this? Uh, right, cool. Uh, bloop, there we are. Okay, so you jump down to there and you can nom, grab it. Lovely. Alrighty. What's, what's, this, what's this even here? Missionary. Hmm. I mean, we need a religion to actually start getting our faith bonuses because if we have a religion, we'll get plus five for every other religion we know of. So we're getting stupid amounts of faith. Which, wait, does it have to be our own religion, I wonder? Hopefully not. Because otherwise we've, we're just completely screwed. Um, oh, nice, quad marine. Rightio, you can go park up over here. We'll use the fish as our gathering point. Oh, I've... Completely fucked it there. There we go. Lovely. And you park on the fish as well. Lovely. Okay, so let's pull a galley. Yeah, two turns. That's fine. A galley, you want to go... Maybe we want to grab a trader. Just move it between our cities. No, let's, let's build a galley here. So we have one more galley. And we weren't going to have a trader here. Now, one more galley. <clears throat> and then that'll be that, right? Oh, and we get to build the mine. Here we go. So now we're going to hold it. Want gold and a bit more production. That's fine. So once we build these two extra galleys... Um... Shit. <laughs> he will like me, though, because I have a strong navy. So... Weirdly okay. How you doing, Harold Sigurdström? It's an honor to meet you. I have traveled far and wide, but I have never—I've not always gone full Russian. I have traveled far and wide, but I have never seen your capital. Tell me of it. Uh, it's a capital. It lives on an island. It's shit. It's horrible. It's the worst. But with this actually fairly formidable navy, we should be able to uh, start grabbing some mainland cities. Right, rest and repair. Yeah, Link, what's this? Cocoa for money. Oh, okay. Oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. 
You're just the best. Are ye? Where are you? Oh, oh shit, that's Nidoros. How did we discover Nidoros? Like, what? I oh, mean, maybe we saw one of his ships, actually. That's probably uh, what happened. Okay, another galley. So, let's get you guys rolling over here. Lovely. And now, you can... Whoa, one turn? Let's, let's spend two turns on a quad marine. Because I guess we had leftover production. So we'll have a seriously strong navy. And then, uh, actually, let's just buy our trader in uh, what's called Maduri. Probably should have bought it last turn. Bastard. Come on. Right. Purchase. Trader. Radio. And... Let's build us a monument to get our borders expanding a little bit faster. Okay. Um, roll up. Our fleet is now just going to roll up and catch up and form a giant armada. I can't wait to actually be able to form armadas as well. They're pretty cool, the way they work. Okay, you can bark yourself, that's fine. You go to sleep. Lovely. You run over there. Cool. Preparing for the biggest... <laughs> it's Indian D-Day, that's what it is. Gandhi's going to smash down and corner it. Oh my god, a settler. Shit, if only we were the Norwegians. We could have uh, snatched that real quick. Although I guess... Ah, there's a warrior guarding it. Damn it. Right, so we can now go to Hadan, get some golden faith, or we can go to food and production. I think food and production is the better choice. And we'll also get a road between our cities, which will be awesome. So, let's go... Should we have a tunnel of stuff? Let's grab a settler. No. Let's build a spearman. And now here's my log uh, logic behind this. We're going to build a spearman and we're going to send him over to like keep the peace on the new world when we end up conquering it. So let's uh, roll you over to here. Lovely. Are you the, you're the galley? Okay. Alrighty. You can roll on up as well. Cord marine. Off you go. Okay, cool. How many, how strong is our navy? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ships. That's actually not that bad, honestly. I'm impressed. Seven, uh, seven ships from India in just, a what, like, 20 turns, I think? Less, actually. I think we're gonna smash them. We're gonna crump them good. Rightio. Um, now this spearman can go run over to here and prepare to invade. Meanwhile, we're just going to build an encampment, maybe? Encampments are pretty good, because they give you a lot of production bonuses, but maybe we'll save it for a uh, an actual industrial sector. So, instead, let's produce, uh, let's produce a settler, sure. We'll send it across to the New World when we uh, land on it. Maybe we can whack one, like, here, get an extra city. Ooh! I have sent you traders with gifts of rune stones. They are powerful. The stones, not the traders. But I'm sure they're powerful too, Mr. Norwegian. Rightio. Let's see. Have they got city walls? No, they don't. This city should fall in no time. Now, here's what we're going to do. So we're going to go. I think you are good. All leaders incur hatred and unpopularity. If one has a great aim to pursue, this burden of envy must be accepted. Oh boy, oh, oh you sweet, you sweet summer child, oh you, d you're not going to see this coming. <laughs> the Indians are coming, the Indians are coming! Just flying over the, f the hills in their quad marines, yes. 26, okay so next turn should put us into, um, not, uh, what's called, not surprise war territory. Just because I'd rather not get all the bloody negative debuffs and everyone hate me again. I'd rather everyone love India. Oh, nice. You're improving my uh, soon-to-be settlement. That's very nice of you. Ain't you just the best? Okay. Let's see. Entertainment? No, 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 no. Harbour? I guess... Does, do harbours count towards... They are a district. Oh, I guess we'll just build a harbour. Screw it. Or maybe an entertainment... Let's go entertainment complex, because we'll, uh... We'll end up needing one with the amount of people we're going to get in Delhi. So, whack it on the coast there. Lovely. What? 
What? What? Um, excuse me, game. Gandhi's just declared war on himself. <laughs> now we will test your strength. Prepare yourselves. Declares a formal war against you. I will not allow the Empire to suffer this oh, to, to suffer you any longer. The time has come to end this charade. Declares a formal war against you. Gandhi? Did you? Oh my god, I know what happened. No, no, don't tell me. Okay, I think I know what happened. I think I told someone to move on to a spot where they were, and they're like, okay, I'll move on to a spot where that guy is, and attacked them. I think, at least. Sure as hell hope not. Anyway, let's, uh, declare a formal war. Oh my god, oh, Cassius Belaith, finally. His beard is really good. Look at it. Look at it. <gasps> Soldiers are not like trees. When they are destroyed, they cannot be easily replaced. Uh, do you easily replace it? Doesn't a tree take hundreds of years to grow? Who the fuck easily replaces a tree? Now, can I? No, but I can roll these guys to here. And I can't actually bombard that because that's not a unit. So, we'll just chill, I guess. Actually, what we can do is roll you boys up to here. Bish bash bosh. And roll you guys to here. And skip your turn, lovely. And sleep. Cool. The invasion begins. It's a bit of a difficult spot. If they had two range, we'd have this guy destroyed in no time. But as it is, we're going to have to land some troopers. It's still ten turns before we can... Uh... Oh. Hello, hoplites. Hello, every chariots. Yeah, I can see an issue. It's already back up to 199 health. Fuck. We have to land some troops. Hmm. Actually, what we can do is just roll this guy to here and bombard you. There we go. Wow, you are remarkably strong, that guy. Um, How is he so strong? Look at this, right? Oh, hang on, he's on the left. I'm on the right. Okay. This is actually a scary galley we have to murder, but I think that's fine. Let's just send this ship to sort of blockade this side of the river, make sure nothing comes up. Yeah. Actually, now roll all the way down to there. There we are. Yeah, I feel like this garrison ain't about to drop, so... Nine turns, and then we can send the boys across. What do you mean, headed toward bankruptcy? How can you survive with it? I, I have plenty of gold. Silence yourself. Stop these outrageous lies. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake. 190. We are dropping it by one HP. One HP a turn. God, no. Right, tell you what. Galley goes to here. Galley bops him in the face. Lovely. Galley gets promotion. I'm going to use this one to bombard his chariots. Lovely. And that's all happy and good. Cool. Alright, so we just uh, continue then. Yes, invasion's going to be a lot harder than I thought. I'm going to leave you there to cut off that passage. That's fine. Like, these guys should be able to take the city. It's just we need to... It's still, what, eight turns before we can ship across? Hmm. Let's attach and sleep you. Come on. Right. What? Oh, right, from Greece, not, uh... Oh, shit! While defending, your galley was destroyed by a Japanese galley. Not anymore. Come on, give it, give it to me. Give me control. Boosh. Finally, he's dead. Okay. Oh, promotion. Promoted. 
district defences, district defences. I assume bombardment also applies to... Let's get, let's, this one can go down the uh, left tree, and this one will go down the main tree, so... What, what's its HP now? 191, we're slightly lowering it, everyone! Ooh, it's getting close! Maybe by next year we'll be in, uh, we'll be in, it's called, Corinth. It'll be mine. Really, I don't even need all these ships. I'm going to send this one back for repairs. I'm going to leave two to blockade the rivers. Ooh. D sure. Give me money. Since I'm so headed for bankruptcy. Oh, it's horrendous. Actually, that's a good point. We have a shit ton of faith, right? Let's have a look at great people. And there we go. We could... Looks like we're going to... No, we're going to lose that one. We should buy this one with faith. There's no one else we can buy with faith, is there? No? Okay. Buying with faith it is. Our dedication. Our dedication. Why is she Scottish? Hey, here we are. Finally on the turn. Unfriendly. At war. Why are we at war with Japan? They will pay me one gold for 30 turns to be at peace with them. I didn't even declare war on you, I think. I'm like 90% sure I didn't declare war on you. How has that happened? Is that just a thing that happens with Japan? I fucking hope not. It's like, and now you're at war. Fuck you. Not all who wander are lost. <gasps> Hallelujah. You know what? You know what? I think. Oh, I. Oh my god, look at this. Archery and animal hus. I don't have animal husbandry because I have no animals on my fucking island. But square rigging. Yes. Right here. Let's go Great Library, maybe? Ooh, we could go straight up. Some serious, serious, uh... What do you call it? Uh, Wonder Production? Yeah, I can see that. Sure, let's do this. So we go... Great Library, so that's four, uh, two science, four faith, one plus science, uh, scientist points, and two great works of writing. Let's do it. Meanwhile, you can... Whoa, you get three production from a jury. Watch, we're going to take 22 turns to build it right now. 17 turns with the trader running. Holy shit, that trade is awesome. Oh god, that's getting so low. Okay. Here we are. Okay, this one's almost... Oh, we can name it now. Here we go. The Iron Shark. The Fighting Orca. The Second Buccaneers. The Sacred Intrepid. Okay, I'm just going to close my eyes and... We got the Drawn Conqueror. This is, this, is, this is all right. Uh-oh, trouble in paradise. It looks like the horsemen have jumped into the ocean, and I have no idea why. Actually, looking at this, it's going to be hard to kill them. Like, strangely difficult. <gasps> Promotion, yes. Look, if I just whop. They can't damage me, but I, I do really small amounts of damage. Huh. Kind of wishing I had this guy over there now. Oh, well. Oh, for f oh, I am actually stupid. <sighs> Remember that army that should have been moving across there like two turns ago? That I should have... Oh! Oh! Remember that army I should have been moving across there yeah, like two turns ago? Hmm, yeah, hmm, 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was smart of me, wasn't it? Tell you what. Let's have a good, good settler. Okay, so he says that these locations aren't all that bad. Let's just get our boys over to there. Yeah, no, stop that auto-swapping, I swear to God. Oh my God, piss off. Auto-swapping is the worst. And we get to name this one. It is the Magnificent Conqueror. Great. You guys can beat up the uh, horsemen. Cool. And here we are. You can all roll over to here, and you can join them. Now, what we're going to do is hopefully just set up a nice little defensive landing. Oh, shit, we can get a caravel. 180 gold? Yes, please. Let's have a quick look at her. Oh, my, she's a beauty. Norway has just declared war on Hong Kong. Interesting. Wait, people are going to the medieval. I'm already in the Renaissance, aren't I? 
Am I? How far ahead am I? Renaissance, yeah. Oh my god, I'm ahead of everyone. I did not think I was going to be that good on... Oh, I suppose it's because I've gone down this path. Look at this. I've gone straight for cartography. I, th I literally skipped the entire medieval age. Look at this. I skipped all that age to go straight to cartography. I have never, ever been in the medieval age. That's kind of good. That, that, oh, kind of good. Kind of a... Uh, kind of a giggle. Bit of a laugh. Oh, shit. Also, he can just move across open ocean. So, uh, that's, that's, that's actually a pretty good, uh, pretty good advantage, isn't it? Okay. Oh, it's slow enough to die. Come on. Um. We now just have to get a... I suppose we get a carrot. No. So, here's what we do. Pull back, you. Bombard this guy. Lovely. Whop this guy in the face. Good. And then hopefully we'll now be able to, uh, what's it called, pull back the bombardment ship and move in a, a uh, little capture ship next turn. Right, let's build. Let's build a builder and get him to, that's called improve all the little bits and pieces. Look at this fleet. It's lovely. So something I just remembered. Oh, sorry, Sun Tzu. Look. It doesn't matter the ship type, it just matters whether you have the tech or not. So, with that now in mind, I suppose there's no real point for me to defend like that, so I'm just going to roll over and uh, keep my guys where they are relevant. Now, decisive victory. Can't actually move into there, can you? Right. I pulled you back here. Right. Shit, that was close, but not close enough. Oh, also, you're the fucking... Caravel, damn it! You're not sorry. You're not the uh, Caravel. You're the bloody Quad Marine. That's what I was looking for. Right, bombard you. That's fine. You guys can uh, have a bit of a bosh there. We can bombard him as well. But I think what we're gonna have to do is we have to move you in, bombard, and then pull it. Or maybe, maybe the Caravel can just one shot the city because it's pretty low. We'll see. Also about to land this bloody... Look at this invasion fleet. Gandhi's D-Day. Oh my god. That's annoying. Because that's just stopped me from capping the city. What a bunch of cunts. Rightio. Let's start bombardment then. Okay. And then Caravel can whop him. Okay, you can run us to Delhi, get us some food and uh, production, that's fine. Oh, what's uh, Delhi suffering from? Amenities? Yeah, I'll have to build, uh, actually, I suppose we can just, was it 360 to purchase an arena? Yeah, we'll come back when we've got that. Okay, now, let's see, is this, is anywhere here okay to build a, uh, I don't think so, no one's really happy to build a, uh, what's called a city. Hmm. Let's have a pick around the coast with this ship. Don't see much, that's for sure. Okay. Uh, yep, skip turn. Skip turn, lovely. Right, now hopefully the bloody horses get out of my way and I can just go in and grab the city with my caravel. I think I should just be able to 1v1 it. Oh god, if they build walls now. No, 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 no. Please no. Look at this stupid amount of horses that Greece has. Okay. I think we're good. Actually, I'm pretty sure we're good because we can now roll... What's this one? That's the... Okay, so we need to roll this one forwards. You can bombard this. That's fine. Um, if I was to say move this one... Okay, you can move through there. Ah, uh, you just kind of tack through that. So, we'll roll you up to here. Cool. And we'll roll you to there. Oh, wrong person. So, you can actually just bugger off to there. You go to there. Bombard this guy. That's fine. And you can go join your brothers in battle. That's okay. So, now we've got the two bombards here. They'll cover my guy. And he should be able to just 1v1 the city to death. Whew. 
Right. Ooh. This is not looking friendly. Hmm. You know, I think I'm going to settle a city here just to be like an, a province because we need, so yeah, like a, what's called an outpost because we need something. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh. Here's the problem is we need to actually land our, uh, our men. We're being a bit surrounded. I'll toss it, just whop him. There we are. Okay. You always look around here. Hey, Norway, how you doing? Okay. Tell you, you can go on auto explore because they've now uh, been unlocked, haven't you? So this one is just going to explore the world because it can now go see everything. Lovely. Hopefully, we'll finally meet a city state and we can give them all of the envoys. That's the thing that's gimped us most, I think. We've lacked city states and they can give some seriously big bonuses. Oops. There goes the slinger. Okay, so... Fuck it, let's do it. Found in city. And then you can... Whop them. Whop them. Oh, nice, you actually landed in. Spearmen are effective, perhaps they need a longer weapon, however. No, no, I think their weapon is quite fine. Quite fine indeed. Uh, you can just roll over here. Bash up some horses on the ocean. Okay. Lovely. Oh, do it. Oh! Oh my! Well, that fell quickly. I took pretty much no damage, and it's going to fall this turn. Oh! Yeah, that's quite nice. Okay, let's, let's go get this stone first, and we'll grab the other two bits. And what else do we want? Let's grab an encampment. I think we should have an encampment. At least one. Yeah. What one there? Rightio. Now you should definitely have a granary to actually be able to feed yourself. Hey, Nidoros. Wow, look at Nidoros. That is a quietly nice way to... Oh! What guides you? Surely you cannot believe in nothing. Come on, show your people the light. Oh, just I was looking at your city. Okay. Um. I wonder. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. What does... Oh, yeah, just look at this. What's... There's more Great Walls of China. What do they actually do? Man, it looks cool, though. Oh, oh, here we are. Here we are. Let the bombardments begin. Right, um... Hmm. Let's just get everyone in a defensive line. Just ready to hold them off. Promotion. Plus 5 against them, plus 10 against melee. How would we... Oh, square is really good. But we don't have any support equipment... Uh, support units at the moment. So we're just going to thrust. Cool. And thrust. Yep. Then you boys can beat this horse up. Beat my horse up. Right. And let's do it. <gasps> yes. Also, hang on a moment. We have domesticated animals despite not knowing animal husbandry because we've captured a city. That makes sense. Well then, let's uh, repair them on. No. We kind of, we, uh, we should build a bit, uh, let's call build walls, but repair the monument and purchase something to defend the city, please. Oh, I'm selected city. Right, uh, a spearman might work. Yes, I think I think it'd be best, actually. Spearman, nice. Fuck, that's a lot of horsemen, though. Jesus. Hmm. Yeah, how do they support this many horses? They can't, they can't have that many horse units in their empire. Like, hang on, how many have I even seen? Nowhere near enough to hold, like, that many horse. No. In that, that is an impossible number of horses. I, I call shenanigans on those horses. More importantly, like, they just, they don't stop coming. There were so many of them, they put some of them in the ocean, like, you will fit here now, horsies. And like, nay. My god. 
Oh, okay. Oh, looks like you're about to die. Yup. Whoop. Uh, whoop. Down. Good. Okay, armor up. Oh, for fuck's sake, another horse has hopped in here. Oh, Cor they've actually left Corinth alone, because they, I guess they have not siege equipment or something, or they just don't want to bother. But, uh, let's murderize this horse. And then, uh, we'll roll the galley over to help out. Ooh, get a promotion. Plus one, or damage, I think. I think we go damage. Uh, and then this one. Oh, it's built a bloody... They have not built a granary in Corinth. Or maybe maybe it was destroyed, actually. Well, no, you repair them if they're destroyed, so... Maybe they literally didn't. Alright. Hey, there you go, the horses. Lovely. Uh, helmsman. Plus one movement. Cool. And... Again. What? Let's just have a go at him. Just deal some damage. Lovely. Now... Oh, we can put a step well here. What does a step well do? I'm trying to remember. Gives us faith in something else. Is it just... Oh, is it... F it has something to do with holy science, I think. So, maybe we shouldn't bother. Why are there horses over here? The horses have followed my galley. Dear God, why? Why, galley? Just go on an adventure. There's more Greeks in the ocean. Why are they all in the ocean? Oh, look at that. We've uh, let's, let's call it Kyoto. But what is this map even meant to be like? Because I'm guessing there's like there's like an ocean that runs through here up to Kyoto. Kyoto, I think you say so. There's all oh, there's Valletta. <gasps> We've met up for a city state. Holy shit! Yes. And they are of course production the best. Confirm. Are we near the, uh, s no, Jesus, but we should be, because we can then purchase buildings with faith, okay, uh, let's see, what if I wanted your religion, how would I go about that, let's send a delegation to these people, hey, your delegation has arrived, we welcomed them with a feast in the longhouse. Nice. I'm kind of wishing there was some way to, uh... What's it called? Get them to give me their religion. Because I just need something. Someone. Let's see. Uh, where are we? Religions? Oh, yeah, now they've all appeared. Weird. Where are we? Yeah, okay, so I actually just need to get one. Well, whatever. Let's keep... Ex what do you want to do with these boats? Do you just want to... Look at the fucking horses. We cannot leave... Like, we can't leave town for the amount of horses there are. I guess let's just keep bombarding and all that. Heal out of friendly territory. Defend against air. Let's... Yeah. Heal out of friendly. Heal out of friendly. You all can go get... Upgraded, I guess. That's really the only thing you can be good for. We're going to have an elite navy by the end of this, so it be real bloody good. Um. Hmm. Yeah, one plus movement, sure. You're already pretty strong. Oh, what? Why is this? No, get back in there. Actually, sure, you can hop to here and then bug down there. Why has this guy just hopped out of his... Ugh, whatever. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, just, just go around. Keep exploring, please. Oh my god, they're everywhere. They're just filling the oceans. <sighs> joint war, Catherine... De I have not met this person, but we're about to joint war her. Wait, hang on a second. Hang on. He wants me to give him citrus, join in a war, and open my borders, and he'll pay me 129 gold. Let's not do the war. Um. What's your price, boy?
What? What? Hang on. 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 It went from him accepting to, uh, to pay for oranges into I'm going to give him citrus and I will have to pay for the privilege. No. How about you just give me iron? 10 for 30 turns. Lose that. Oh, okay. That's not as bad. Lose that. Make it more equitable. Lose that. Make it more... Okay. No, I don't even need the iron yet. Fuck it. Sorry, man. Sorry. You're just uh, awful at negotiating. It's all good. Right here, yeah, so I think that's where we'll leave it for now. So D-Day has succeeded. We now have two... Oh, God. Surrounded. Holy fuck. Well, then. That has... Uh, that happened quickly. Let's... Yeah. Attack this guy. Let's go, like, you to here. You to here. Nice. Keep the bombardments up. And then we... Oh. We use you to instantly kill one. Lovely. Down goes one. I think, honestly, that's just the best idea is just to kill them when they hop in the water. But there's so many. What's Pike's Love? It's a military one, isn't it? Or is it production as well? Oh, it's production as well. Hmm. We could probably be easier suzerain as well. Okay. Um, major defeat there. So let's jump up on dry earth. Whop them into a stalemate. That's fine. You'll heal up and we'll probably get murdered. So let's pull you back. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. So three horses against the three units. And a city, that should be fine. Alright. I think it's high time to uh, end the episode. So thank you all for watching. It's a weird game, you know? It's nowhere near a normal game. We got quite heavily fucked, but I think we could still pull this off. If we just keeping... <sighs> the horses are everywhere. If we could keep uh, fighting off Greece, we could probably grab another one of their cities here. I think that might actually be their capital as well. Sails, uh. But the unseen wind that moves a ship. Oh yes, Gandhi's got frigates, and he's coming for your ass. <laughs>